Take two with the new camera. I forgot to turn the microphone on. Welcome back to Redneck Tips by Scott. I haven't done a video in a long time, but I just got this new camera two nights ago from a buddy of mine. And I got a lot of cool stuff going on. I just needed a camera and I need the motivation, but I got this. I need to do a pointer, a magnetic pointer like a mag fridge magnet. And let's go mobile. And bear with me, I'm learning this camera. Alright, they were flipped over. So I got that. Chevy 327, small block, stimulus money on the cylinder heads. You can't really see it, but it's got the the holly set up for the for a Vortec. I want to run a Vortec and I'm, it's gonna go in an 08 Colorado that I got. And I also have an old OM616. Mercedes. Working on my plants. I got all kinds of tomatoes, cilantro, broccoli, cauliflower, the watermelon haven't popped. None of the hot or none of the regular peppers or the hot peppers have popped. But I've got an 80, 85 Camaro with 60, 61,000 miles on it. It's got no redneckery done under the hood except the wrong carburetor you know no cut wires no nothing and the right carburetor is in that box right there and I have to chemically strip it because my dad sprayed two different kinds of spray paint on it but yeah it's ready to go I just gotta strip it and that's an old van seat in there if you ever want a cheap circle track seat in one of these if you got a jump one. But he wrecked his old van and that's where the accessory drive came off of for that 327 sitting in the corner. Uh, got transmission out of his old van. It's a V6 so it'll probably have to be rebuilt but then again I have the the one out of the Colorado which could, I could use, you know, get the bell housing off of it and then redo it, you know, with quality and performance parts but I got HP tuners as well and I already have the credits purchased on this van my dad's van carpenter van and I want to make them a functional ram air hood and I want to make a fiberglass version of it and sell it because there's 714,000 Chevy Expresses and well over that in GMC Savannas but the air box is right there. Yeah, functional, super easy. To get that cold air to the motor so that I could run a little bit more timing, a little bit more gas mileage. But yeah, this is just kind of a test. I'm just running around here with my brand new camera, checking everything out. And there we go. Redneck Tips by Scott.